welcome back to the Tune Project. Today I'll be teaching you how to play Drunken Sailor on the violin. This is particularly great for those of you who consider yourselves to be beginners, so if that's you, then keep watching. And if you enjoy this video and find it to be helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed to the Tune Project, I post videos just like this one every single week, so consider hitting that red subscribe button below along with the notification bell so that you can be notified each time I post a new video. So for this tune, we're in the key of A major, which means we have that A major finger position. So we're working with the A string and the E string. We have a whole step between our first and second fingers and half step between our second and third fingers on both the A string and the E string. So here is the first phrase. We're starting on an F sharp on the E string. So we had a little bit of a shuffle rhythm there, and then we ended on our F sharp. Now we're gonna be starting on open E for the second phrase. All right, and then ending on open E as well. Now we come back to our F sharp and we have the same rhythm as we did in the very beginning, but the notes toward the end of this phrase are slightly different, so be sure to listen for those. Okay, so there at the end, those were the notes that were a little bit different from before. They were all in a row, so it was basically like playing a little scale there on the E string, ending with our fourth finger B. So if you're not as comfortable using your fourth finger, this is where you just wanna make sure that you're reaching all the way up to that B. There's gonna be a whole step between our third finger A and fourth finger B. So make sure that you're reaching up for that note. And then for this last phrase, we're gonna come back to our A, our third finger on the E string. And there we just ended on our first finger B on the A string. And that's really the whole tune as far as notes go. There are some alterations in the rhythm that you can make if you choose to follow along with the traditional song, but I'm gonna go ahead and play all of what we've learned so far, and you're welcome to play along with me just to make sure that you've learned it. One, two, ready, go. So like I said, there are some alterations that you can make in the rhythm if you choose to follow along with the popular song. So because the lyrics change throughout the song, that means the rhythm is gonna change slightly. So for example, in the beginning, we have our shuffle rhythm. But that could change if you choose to So because it's such a short tune, if you wanted to, you could play it a couple of times through, and maybe the first time you could play that rhythm with the quarter notes and eighth notes, and then the second time through, you could play it with those longer half notes to kind of change up the rhythm. Well, congratulations for learning Drunken Sailor with me today on the violin. I hope you enjoyed playing this one, and I hope you have fun with it. I'll see you in the next video. Happy practicing. If you've made it this far, you must have enjoyed the video, so why not check out this one next? Also, if you'd like exclusive content from the Tune Project and a more personalized experience, head over to Patreon and join our wonderful little fiddle community. Your support helps me to continue to grow as a creator and ensures that I'm able to continue to provide free educational content here on YouTube. Thank you!